And then Bob Geldof was in the crowd and he jumps up and he shook my hand and he goes, I know. Well, he didn't know my name, he still thought it was called Eddie Bob at the time. And he shook my hand and, uh, and then Roger Eagle comes up on the stage and then the Clash manager is up and he goes, we've got to manage you guys, we've got to take you London to the Roxy. And it was at that point when the, everything collided and the dark side of rock and roll took over, if you like, and we did go down to London to, to the Roxy and we kind of got stitched up big time and, and John, my friend, who was my dear friend, he got sucked right into the dark of rock and roll. Everyone was offering him cocaine and speed and he took the lot. <laughs> and it was no fun driving by in a full full team, I can tell you, he's speeding around going through the Mersey Tunnel. But he made some big mistakes and he got sucked into the dark side of life and that's the song I sing about in the next song, I'll sing about him. It was, uh, he did go down to jail in Walton Jail in, in Liverpool and spent some of his life in prison and paid a big price for the mistakes he made. I'm still really good friends when we meet, meet up and talk about music and have a pint. And uh, He's a great guy and I can look him in the eye when I speak to him, even though I sung some tough things about him in the song because it's true. And he knows it's true and that's why we're still friends. And so tonight I want to give him the service of updating his story because he's met the challenges that he faced in life. He's paid the price and built something new for himself. And I want to dedicate this song to him and Susie who's in the song with me because they are not just living in the spirit of 76 but they're somewhere between dignity and proud. And I want to dedicate all to you.
Bye. 